Hi guys, it's me, Annie Woods, recording here live from my bedroom. This is episode 15 of the vlog. Um, I'm really grateful to Jenny B from Twitter. She is one of my regular viewers and I'm really grateful that she does come and watch. Um, if you are a regular viewer of this vlog, thank you very much. I do appreciate your, your support in this. Um, if you're not a regular viewer of my vlog, this is the first one you've seen. Go back, look at the others. There's been some slight improvements each time I go through and do this. Um, now, a few things to share this week. First thing is something cool I picked up from the hobby shop. I have no idea precisely how I'm supposed to work with them. But Ta -da, yeah, you can see the price stickers here, a buck forty-nine. Just a bunch of sequins, and apparently I'm supposed to be able to stick the sequins onto the little dots. It's supposed to be sticky. Um, this one's obviously a butterfly to be perfectly blunt. I got nothing on what this one is yet. I'll showcase it next week when I'm done with it. Um, for all I know, it could be like a weird bow or a star or some or a rainbow or something. I don't know. We'll find out next week. Um, another thing I picked up is actually going to go towards, some of it's going to go towards my writing Wednesday. Ta-da! Fictioners Workshop. This book is awesome. It's got all sorts of exercises and cool things in it. Um, it's based on what you might find at a fiction writer's workshop. Um, I went through a whole bunch of books today and I was sorely disappointed. Everything that says how to write sci-fi and fantasy focuses on sci-fi, not fantasy. Kind of irritates me. But I did get an interesting tip off from at least three different books. Um, when you're going fantasy, you want to start with novel length because apparently... That was writer making the weird noise in the background. He wants out. I'm not letting him out. Apparently, short story, short fantasy stories don't sell near as well as short sci-fi stories. And that got me thinking, because I always get my short um, fantasy stories rejected anyway. And I've been told a couple of times that my, my ideas lend themselves to novels, not short stories and itty-bitty stories. So... I'm focusing on the books, on the novels now, but as I said, um, I'm probably going to offer some of the writing workshop things out of here. Not all of them. i um, not going to copy paste the whole book into my blog. That would be tedious. <laughs> but something that really strikes me, I am going to put it up on the Wednesday writing stuff. Um, Ryder is being a little butthead tonight. He wants out of the bedroom and off to play, but he's not getting out. And he's now mauling my hand where I'm petting him. Um, another thing I wish to share. Ta-da! Firefly! I have to pace myself or I'll never get anything done. I put on the first disc, which is the first four episodes, which is the two-parter um, pilot episode, and then three more episodes, the first four episodes. And... I already like it. I mean, I've, I've, I've seen bits and pieces of it. I've never actually sat down and watched the whole thing before. But I have to pace myself because if I actually sit and try and watch all of it, there's going to be no productivity for a long time. Speaking of lack of productivity, I haven't gotten much done this week, but I actually have a very good reason for it. Um, I went uh, in the hospital on Tuesday. I passed out twice at work. Went back in on Friday, which given this is Saturday night would be yesterday, but since you guys mostly won't, most of you won't be watching this till Sunday. So anyway, Friday, went back to the doctor, spent two hours at the doctor. I got a, I'm having bad vertigo. I mean, and it just hits me at random times. I'm supposed to take motion sickness meds to help with the dizziness. And the doctor ordered a CAT scan, and I got a call on Monday to schedule it because I got the message too late on Friday to do it. I don't really want to go stick my head inside a giant magnet, but between the headaches that I have been getting and cannot get rid of, and the vertigo, there may actually be something wrong in there. Not like I'm already not a little cuckoo. <laughs> I think 
<laughs> I mean, I'm trying to make my living as a writer. There, there's a bunch of us that are cuckoo that way. But no, I mean, I'm, uh, I've, I've got my issues, but I hate doctors anyway, but I gotta go stick my head inside a giant magnet here fairly soon. Get the CAT scan done. Um, himself asked me what my, what I wanted for my birthday. My birthday being in May, you know, it's a month away, but he wants some time to plan for it, which is, which is cool and understandable. He asked me what I wanted. Now, he already knows one thing I want. I want an iPod and I want uh, uh, and a gift card to iTunes because I want to be able to download music and have some music to listen to when I'm out run running around, doing my walks, doing my whatever. Um, and I can't really haul Gremlin or Monstrosity. When I get Monstrosity back, I don't want to walk around the block. I look pretty freaking stupid holding my laptop. And, oh, I'm listening to music. Yeah, that doesn't work. <laughs> Um, it's amusing as that, that's, well, actually it's not even amusing, it's kind of dumb sounding, so. But I want an iPod. I'll take an iPod shuffle, I'm not, I told him that. I'll take an iPod shuffle, I'm not picky. Just an iPod, um, and the iTunes gift card. He says, well, what else do you want if I can't get that? I'm like, that's a fair question. I want a teddy bear from Build-A-Bear Workshop, because that's pretty much where I get my teddy bears, unless he wins them for me out of the crane game. That's where Patches came from, and I want another one like Patches. And I want a set or two of fingerless gloves. I have been wanting fingerless gloves forever, and I can never find them. Um, I'm gonna I'm gonna do some research and check into the mall. I'm gonna check online. I'm gonna find where I can get some, and I'm gonna have him get some for me. Or I might just buy them myself and, uh, and give myself a, a birthday present. Um, Well, that's it for this week's vlog. Next week, vlog number episode number 16 will be up and running by Sunday. Anyway, this is Annie Woods signing off for this week. We'll see you guys back here next week, and we'll see you on the blogs here in the meantime. Everybody have a great weekend, rest of your weekend. Have a great week, and we'll see you later. Bye!